Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. Um, if you're new, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, comment on, down below, kind of let me know what's going on, guys. Um, if you're here and you're new to this place, this place is just a, we're called the Shedding Life. We're just about shedding our old lives and stepping into a new one. And uh, I'm doing it myself right now and I'm trying to show you guys how I'm gonna do it if it works. Um, if it works, it's gonna be something you guys can do yourselves. Um, if not, we're gonna, still gonna have a lot of fun. So come join along and let's just have some fun, do some shed hunting, do some adventuring and just have a good time and, and just do it. Let's go guys. Hey guys, I just wanted to show you my car. Um, my wife keeps giving me crap saying I need to clean it. I don't know. We're debating always ever everything. I do lots of stuff that, like this and she thinks that it needs to be cleaned, that it's disgusting. Tell me what you guys think. Like, I sleep in here. Um, that's it. I just sleep in here and then I'm out hiking. So I don't really know what, what it matters if it's clean or not. Um, that's just my thoughts. Let's see, let's see what we got going on in here anyways. Got a camera box, little pink chair, honey buns, baby. See that? Ramen noodles and honey buns. That's what I live off of. And then these little breakfast essentials. Got a little deadhead in here. Got a pile of horns in here. Some shoes, hard candy, hot fries. I'm going the ramen noodles. I'm gonna show you guys how I make them peppers to chew on just I don't know tell me what you guys think I think it's good um, like I say but I'm a boy she's a girl we have different thoughts on stuff so I understand where she's coming from love you babe uh, miss you thanks for being so awesome and letting me do this stuff I know it I know it's hard on you and I appreciate you for just what you do baby love you and uh, hope you're having a great day too, babe. Um, anyways, guys, stay tuned. We're going to have fun today. I can hey feel guys. it. So TWC come down here, and he showed me how it was done, and he picked up the buck I've been watching. I don't even care, though. All I care is that we got him. Look at that thing, guys. Dude, I hope you got the pickup. I did. So I'm going to put the pickup on here for you guys to see. Um, dude. Yeah! Right here. <laughs> TWC right here, guys. If you're not following him, go follow him. He kills it on the deer. He's the deer slayer right here. Like he gets it done on the deer. Me and him can do a lot of good things this year with deer. And then hopefully I can maybe teach him a thing or two about elk, but we'll see. Um, anyways, stay tuned guys. We got all day. We've only been going about an hour. He just found it not more than 70 yards away from this tank. I just missed him. Suck, but I'm just glad he got picked up. Well guys, we just taped him out 81 and a half inch bone right there look at that thing we're gonna see if we can't find the other side here for a minute so stay tuned right, guys you guys I got one it's a monster <laughs> a little chalker two-point baby yeah we're just getting started we moved spots tried to match up that nice buck wasn't able to we'll go back in there later and try again but we're gonna try a new area and we're just getting going and we got one so maybe a good day talk to you soon well guys just been going and I got a shed. It almost looks like it may be a brownie, but I'm not sure. Um, hold up and I'll flip this around. We'll walk up on him. Right there, guys. I mean, they're all pretty light. That's a brownie. Brown three point. Woo! Let me get a picture, guys.
sweet. Oh, uh, y'all, let's do the pickup. Nice little three point, nice and brown. Awesome, that's two brownies today for us. Not too shabby. We'll just hit this a little bit, see if we can't pick up the other side. Stay tuned, y'all. Hey guys, what's up? Uh, so we're done for the day. We're gonna go spotting now, but uh, I'm gonna go over the finds real quick with you. So today, I think we found like 11 or 12 horns. Um, one of the guys found a dead ram buck. We just left it. Um, we should have marked it and reported it, but oh well. Um, so here we go. Got this big two point. Another big two point. Another big two point with an eye guard. Pretty sweet little buck. Nice little three point. Been a great day, guys. We had a fun. Got this cool looking buck. Broke off. He would have been pretty cool. Pretty freaky looking sucker. And this one, another kind of crazy one. A little four point. Pretty sweet little buck. And we got another. Another crazy looking four point. He's pretty cool. Nice big back forks. Nice little buck. And then I got my three point brownie. I don't have the little two point. I don't know where it is. And then we threw one at a rabbit and didn't pick it up. So we lost a couple. Um, and then we got this big boy that old TCW found. Look at that guys. Freaking monster. Happy for this guy right here. Drove a long ways to come down here and go with me, and it paid off, so. Been a great time, hope you're all having a great day, and we're just gonna go look for some bucks. If I see anything cool and can video it, I will. If not, then it's just over. And we'll see you tomorrow. We're gonna hit it again in the morning, so. Stay tuned, guys, have a great night, and talk hey to you guys later. back again. So, we missed a horn that was in the truck. Got one, another cool little four point. So, all in all, we found one, two, three, Four, four, four points, one, two, three, four, five, two points, one, two, three points, and I think I missed another four point. So, all in all, a great day. We had a lot of fun today, so see you later, guys. Hey, guys, so what's up? So, uh, it's just about getting dark. We're gonna have some dinner. So, I'm gonna cook these boys up some old school jailhouse style burritos and show you guys what's going in here. So, I've got some peppers, sweet peppers, ramen noodle, chili. Spicy picante chicken. We got some good old Chester hot fries. These these ones. If you're gonna do these, has to be these. Can't use anything else. It just won't be good. Got some summer sausage and some good old Velveeta sliced cheese. And we're gonna cook it in a garbage sack. Got the water over here getting hot right now. I'm gonna throw this all together and then I'm gonna kind of show you how I do this once I'm ready to mix it all up. So stay tuned y'all. Hey guys, so uh, here we are, we're ready to cook up some dinner. I sliced up some of the summer sausage, sliced up some of the peppers, got all these ramen noodles broken up, and then I got some crunched up hot fries in there. So we're just gonna take a couple of these. I'm not gonna do them all in the video just so we can kind of show you what I do. I'm gonna take a couple of these, take the packet out, Throw that in there. I'm gonna take this and throw it in. Take this meat, throw it in. I haven't got the cheese yet, but I'll probably put four pieces, five pieces of cheese in there. Um, make sure you, if you're putting cheese, it's hot water so it melts. If not, it's nasty. Um, with the packets, don't put all the packets. You're only gonna put about, because of all the other stuff with the seasoning, you're only gonna put about three full packets in there and that's it. And add hot water. I'll show you that once we get there, so stay tuned. I got all the fixings in there. Basically, we're just gonna take this garbage can. See, I tied off the bottom. You just do that so it doesn't get down in all the cracks. So I'm just gonna fold this up and I'm just gonna mix it all up nice and good. That's probably good for now until we get the water, so stay tuned for that, and I'm gonna show you how we do that. Mm -hmm. Hey guys, so we got the hot water, got it boiling. I'm just gonna dump it right in there. Just dump it in. I got two bottles. I don't know if it's gonna be enough. We're gonna have to take a look and see. 
And then once you get the water in there, you just want to kind of mix it around real good. And break that up, mush it in. And get a good consistency going on in here. Let's check it out. See that? Looks like a big, beautiful mess. Um, probably don't have enough water in there, so I'm going to have to hurry and boil some more up and get it going. One thing you can do to test it is you just squeeze it up here. And basically you want it to look like this. All, basically all the way up to the top. So I'm just a little bit short. So I'm gonna put some more in. That's all I'm gonna show you guys though. Um, basically you just let it sit about 10, 15 minutes, wrap it up tight, and, it, and then you're gonna kind of move it around as it's cooking because if you leave it like that, all the water is going to come down and all the seasoning is going to be at the bottom and the stuff on top is not going to get seasoned. So, just a good idea. Maybe something you guys can try. Super cheap and easy to eat like this and that's how we do it down here at The Shedding Life. Hey guys, sorry I'm here in Arizona not getting very good service. I'm trying to get TWC's clip of the big boy pickup, but it's not coming through. So I'm just going to post the video without it and he's going to post like Sunday night or Sunday sometime. So just go over and follow his page, subscribe to him, and you'll be able to watch the pickup there and kind of see see how he did. He killed it today on the horns. I think he found five or six, so he's the shed hound. So anyways, stay tuned, guys. going to be another great day tomorrow, and I'll be posting another video tomorrow night. So hope you all having a great day, and have a great weekend enjoying what you do. So see you guys.